Hey guys, how's it going? I usually don't do any reviews on apps, but since this was just released today, I saw it in the Play Store while I was updating, I thought to myself, heck, why not, let's give it a go, and this is none other than SwiftKey, in my opinion, the best keyboard app for Android devices. As you guys can see, I'm using my Nexus 4, before that I had an HTC One X, and I just wasn't impressed with the stock keyboards that came preloaded on those phones. I always seemed to make too many mistakes, it didn't really learn my words too well, and I was always looking for that mythical app or that one app that would fill that void for my keyboard. And with SwiftKey, it has a bunch of different themes. You guys just saw that I chose Berry. Let's keep it red and funky, why not? And I'm about to choose a quick little text message to you guys to show you what the keyboard's all about. And before this update, SwiftKey 4, they didn't have swipe to text, which is something I really missed from stock Android, but now finally it has swipe to text and they call it flow writing. So with that I can use my finger to swipe around the letters and it'll type something. And this is the first time I've actually used flow writing for SwiftKey on this phone and you can see every word was bang on, which is definitely a testament to how good this app actually is. And you can see there's a bunch of different emoticons, little smiley face, and the number pad as well as a bunch of different other symbols. This app runs around 99 cents, so before you guys quickly go out and purchase or buy your next pack of Skittles or Bubblicious, save that dollar that you're about to spend, and heck, I'm even helping you save your life a bit, and try this app out. For 99 cents, you will definitely, in my opinion, get the best keyboard that you'll ever have, and you'll never have to worry about it again. It works perfectly in landscape mode, as you guys can see. I'm shooting off a quick message. But let me know what you think in the comments down below if SwiftKey is in fact your favorite keyboard, if you guys have been using it before, or in fact that you have a different app, and maybe I'll take a look at that. But for now, check out SwiftKey. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick review, and I will catch you guys in the next video.